Hey guys, it's Melissa. Welcome back for another video. In today's video, we are talking about what will I buy from Sephora? Don't forget to comment down below. Let me know. It doesn't have to be from Sephora, but let me know your number one product that you think that I maybe hadn't reviewed yet in terms of hair care products. Y'all know I love and my passion is to bring you the best quality tips and tools of the optimal hair beauty experience here on my channel okay so i actually printed out from sephora this is my loves list so these are things that i've clicked on and i definitely am intrigued about them and i want to give a try so we're going to start off with sephora we can do beauty supply like sally's we can do ulta we can have a will i buy it theme so comment down below let me know even if there are some online items that you would like for me to try so we're going to go ahead and do Sephora. And so the first item that I have is the Briogeo Be Well Organic Australian 100% Tea Tree Oil. Now, this intrigued me. There's a lot of tea oil, love tea tree oils, right? But two things intrigued me. Number one, this is a new product from Briogeo and I haven't tried a lot of their products I have tried maybe three of like their entire line which I have not even reviewed for you guys which means that uh, if I totally was turned off I probably wouldn't even talk about them in this video but this is what intrigued me number one the brand number two when it's from their be well line what intrigued me is that it showed so many different ways to use the tree, tree, tea tree oil. The tea tree oil, it showed three different, well, actually six different ways. So you can actually take this oil, put it in your favorite shampoo. You can use it as a scalp treatment. And I don't know if you guys know, but right now I'm on a healthy hair journey and healthy scalp, healthy ends is the way to go in terms of, you know, making sure that you have optimal hair growth it is $32 for let's see how many ounces does it say how many ounces well I'll put all the stuff up I'll put all the of the deets on the screen but it's expensive Briogeo is not cheap it's at Sephora and of course you have the Sephora VIB I have the spring sale and I have the one in November well I want to try this more sooner than later and what's the difference between any other tea tree oil I want to know the difference okay that's something that I definitely would purchase but probably on sale okay and Briogeo actually has sales and Ipsy has their discount so one way or the other I probably would be able to get this product something that I would try but it's not jumping out at me like get me now talk about another Briogeo product that I am intrigued about and this is the Briogeo curl charisma rice amino and quinoa frizz control gel now I actually have a small sample of this I have not tried it this is what's crazy I think I haven't tried it because I don't think it's enough for I don't know if it's the sample size or the the deluxe size I think it's the sample size listen when it comes to curly hair you have to have more product than like a one ounce you gotta have to me at least two ounces or more in order for it to be a good sample so I would actually have to have two samples of that and um, that gel I'm not one that just scrunches on the end I like to actually rake through gels so this is something I definitely would want to try I would probably try this one way quicker than the tea tree oil because this one is twenty dollars for 5.5 ounces okay still a pricey gel but this one I saw was glycerin free so I am really in intrigued about that and so the Curl Charisma line actually the shampoo the conditioner the leave-in conditioner they have a leave-in spray I believe they have a gel I am so intrigued with all of those items actually the entire line, like like I said okay one more um, Briogeo product that I am extremely ex like I'm probably going to get this probably quicker than anything else besides the gel and that is the Briogeo Be Gentle Be Kind Avocado and Quinoa Co-Wash. I am on a co-wash kick right now 
just because I think in order to optimize the moisture in my hair, especially when it's dry, I think co-washes and cleansing conditioners are really, really good in the fall and winter. This is when I really want to try co-washes. So um, this one retails for $32. You get 16 ounces of product. They do have one for $58 and you get 33.8 ounces of product of course the larger size is the better value but when I'm trying something I, I may not like it you know why pay $58 for something I always say even though it's not the best deal usually go for the smaller size if your hair can handle it okay so this is a 16 ounce I, I have you know I want to try it I want to try it and it got some good ratings so that is what I want to try from Briogeo. The last things I want to try. I know I had to pull this out, right? The Olaplex Number no. Four Bond Maintenance Shampoo and the Olaplex Hair Perfector. Now I'm not putting the sh the conditioner in here because y'all know I like to deep condition, and so the first thing that I want to try is the Olaplex Hair Perfector. That's number three. Okay. It retails for $28. I know Olaplex Flex is expensive, but it is one of the most talked about hair products that I have ever heard of from Sephora. Like across the board, you know, wavy, straight, curly, coily, you know, any type of hair, I have heard about Olaplex being bomb. So above everything, I probably would try Olaplex and I would try it on my curly hair. I would try it on my, more so on my straight hair, you know, my straight hair, but it's a hair, especially that hair mask. Y'all, y'all know I have a love for deep conditioners, but those are the things that I would try. $28 for the hair perfector. The shampoo is $28. A $28 shampoo, Lord have mercy, but I'm going to tell you, shampoos can make the difference in uh, your hair hairstyle. I know some people say shampoo is just a shampoo. I beg to differ. I do have a video on how to pick the perfect shampoo for you and co-washes and shampoos that I love. I need to like do a remake, but I will link down in this video that that uh, video that I was talking about. But those are the things currently that I am wanting to try from Sephora in this Will I Buy It Wednesday. Don't forget to comment down below. Let me know what you are really, really wanting to try. Don't forget that I'm doing Will I Buy It Wednesdays at the end of every month. So we got some time to, you know, stock up for February. You know what I'm saying? Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.